look how cool. So, here's some of the things I hung. I'm sure I've done this before. Last time, my phone cut off, and I promised you all that I would show you the finish panel. It did warp a little, but it's okay. I'm going to put in a frame. So, let's see. This is the final print, or the final dried, and it's 11 by 14. And you know what? I don't even think I remember how I did it, but I'm going to take you in to a closer look. I put my light on um, daylight, I think. Anyway. So this is without varnish. And I'm going to put in a regular 11 by 14 black. Um, I hear you, dog. Black um, frame. So, I'll clean off the silicone because I'm sure there's silicone in here. Because most of my leftovers were probably with silicone. So, anyway. I told you I'd show you, and this is what it looks like. Okay, now I'm ready to paint. I haven't painted in a long time. I've been mama sitting for my friend, so I really didn't want to start anything, and I have to clean it up, so, yeah. And here they are. Rings. Graduated rings. Woohoo. So I think I'm going to have to use the baby one. I could reuse that. So I will. Oh. I need scissors. What do I do with my scissors? thought I had everything together. Okay, I'm going to pause you guys. So, I couldn't find scissors there either, so I had to use a knife. So anyway, there's, these are graduated, so I could actually do two if I had a bigger canvas. But since I'm already playing, I'm going to use my 5x7 again. I'm going to use some leftover paint strippings as my background, which is a grayish, purplish, nice thick consistency. And it will cover my last play. Okay. I'm going to tilt this out. Probably get some goobers. Cat here? Yep, I do have a cat. I see it. Oh, it's just stuck in the tape. There is no tape. There it's stuck on the canvas. Ah, Helen! See? See? That's what I get. That's what I get. Good thing this is a bad shirt. Where's my apron? There's times I just want to paint and I don't go protocol wise, so I earn it. So I got me these lovely aprons on Amazon to a pack. Okay. I'm so right on the kini pole pole, right on the ball. I'm sorry, my Hawaiian comes out every so often. I'll try to explain as I go if I do a Hawaiian word. Yay! Bookish knots. That's not a Hawaiian word, but yeah.
So now I'm fully dressed for this here. Piece of yuck. Another piece of yuck. Looks like my hair this time. I'm going bald, help. Okay, that was not a reference to Jada, so don't even go there. <clears throat> my sister has alopecia, so I know what she goes through. And she's had it way longer than uh, Jada, so get over it. No, I'm like, oh. So, let me give a quick. Okay, bubbles. Is that too thick? I think it's thicker than my paint. So, what I wanted to do, I'm going to put this on the side. Well, maybe not on the side, but back. Give a little. I kind of want it off this side, I think. Give a little impression of where I'm going to put my stuff. Huh. Okay. I'm doing this right, but I'll find out. So give me a thumbs up if I think I'm doing it correctly. <laughs> this might be a cool way to get rid of some paint that I have that's like a while ago. Oh, I think that's it for this. I'm going to save this for a little like I want to do. And I want to do it. Okay. Oh, man. I like that one. If you can find paint, you will find it. Just stuck my hand in this little pile of here. So, this came with my uh, plant racks. Well, it's actually a drying rack, but my sister bought it for plants. So I might just drop it here and see what it does as far as putting a bright color there. So I was thinking of doing a live. I've never done one, and it's kind of scary watching everybody else do one. There are some that are professional. I am not one of those. And I fly by the seat of my pants normally, so... Oh, I might put some brown on this one.
I lost my dioxide. I want to try some of this in there. And I don't want to tilt just a bit. I hear you. You're not the only one in this house. I wonder if I made it to the I wonder what would happen if I swept it. Uh, who's got allergies? Okay. Yeah, I think I'm going to swipe it before I put this down again. Just a little bit. Okay, let's find out what happens. Did I muddy it up? Probably. Oh, let me get my little puffer puffer. There it is. Okay, that doesn't look all that great, but it's okay.
Okay. So, I learned quite a bit. I don't know if you folks did. <laughs> um, I got bubbles galore. Note to self. Swiping was okay. Um, here's my other note to self. Bigger canvas. Definitely bigger canvas. Um, I don't know. Oh, shoot! Bang. Okay. Um, swiping. I don't know. I need some white. I'm going to put a drop of white on here. But then I'm going to put some uh, aqua, essential aqua. And then I'm going to put some, maybe a little bit of purple, dioxide purple. I want to see what happens. It's pretty. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it here. Like that. And I'm just going to Oh, I did too much, didn't I? This is more, Helen. just like that. Also, I think what I learned was if you're going to put two planets, uh, you might want to kitty corner them and give them more space in here so that you can do this kind of stuff. This is where I was going with today. Uh, I still got a lot of paint to get rid of. Well, not get rid of, but to use up. So, you're going to see this palette for a little bit. <laughs> I'm sorry. I hope you're not getting bored of it. Um, I don't know. How does it look? I think there's something over there that I just don't. Maybe I need to put a... <laughs> That's our pet, pet pity poo! A Princess Pele! Nothing like having a deaf dog. That you're trying to control and you can't. Okay. Helen, stop already. One more touch. One more touch, guys. One more touch right there on that white. Boop. Ta ta. I think I'm going to spin once. Okay, done. Done. Which one do you like? I like this one simply because it's got cells. And yes, I did use silicone. Um, the background color is not too bad. I kind of like it. So I'm going to keep that. It's, like I said, it's a mixture of everything. So, okay. I'm glad you came to join me on my little play play around, practice. Um, oh, they found something to go run after. Uh, thank you again 
please subscribe if you haven't if you want to see more of this awkward type stuff <laughs> My creative juice is flowing today. I might do another one. I know I got tons of stuff. I don't know if I, I think I showed you guys. I, uh, my open silicone, uh, paints, silicone cups. I keep them in a Rubbermaid. Like this. And they sit in here really nice. See, watch. Oh, that one's empty. I don't want that one in there. It sits in here like this. And I put my brown back in. Like this. And these are covered, so I don't have to worry about them. And then what I do is I just take this and cover it. My advice, though, is when you open it, pop it open and stand back a little bit. Let it air out because it is paint. So it will have the odor or the gases or the toxins. I don't know what they are will come through and that's my tip for today <laughs> oh my goodness oh who we hope until we meet again this is Helen from Hanukkah Lani Creations wishing you the bestest day ever